him Andrew. Hello, my name is Eli. My name is Julia. I'm Taylor. Here's a trash bag hanging from an underwater tree, and I know that the beavers are gonna make a fun home out of me. For it was splendid. It was good. It was really great. It was very, very full of love. It was life affirming, for sure. A lot of naked bodies. Ooh, and outdoor pooping, yeah, definitely. Virote, they are uh, three of the fucking coolest people. Uh, really tall. They have like, they're like the tallest <laughs> band. <laughs> what does Frank look like? Tell me. They're all brown they're all boys. Very tall. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah, they're excellent. They're crazy like us. We get crazier together in the car. Oh, got out of hand. Yeah. <laughs> we got too many stories that we probably couldn't tell people. But <laughs> what? <laughs> well, they're very secret. My husband is a peach. Eugene was cool. Before the show, we stood around at the skate park right next to it, <laughs> right next to the bow rail. And we we picked out uh, little baby boys, skater boys, and we were like, I like that one and that one and that one. And they were doing amazing things. There was a kid on a scooter who did backflips out of the bowl. And like, like and we were like, my boy! <laughs> it was great. And, and then there was a kid there smoking cigarettes. Sorry, kid, if your mom is listening. <laughs> but... He was smoking up a joint. No, I'm just kidding. It was a cigarette. And uh, he was like, you guys need to be here every day to tell people how cool they are. Hey, do a backflip. And the kid did a backflip. <laughs> well, I thought I was the only one. I think it was good. It was, it was like at least one or two people like that we felt had like a deep connection with the music at some point. Yeah. Some of like the people who like threw the show and stuff like that, they would tell us that like they don't hear like like music like that often come through like that, you know? So it was really cool. And Berrote, dude, it was like, it, it was really cool to play, like especially back to back with them because it felt really different than the other stuff we were hearing too, but it was just super rad. I think we uh, did very good there, everywhere. It was very fun, but very well received. I actually told a bunch of scary stories in the car. Like three. <laughs> like three. Portland was completely iced over, which, like, yeah, it was like three inches of ice everywhere. Um, we had chains, but we didn't use them because we didn't really drive. We tempted God. <laughs> yeah. um, but that was probably, like, the only thing we were kind of scared about. Um, oh, our, the, the lights on the trailer went out. Oh yeah, from uh, Washington all the way back down, we had no tail lights or brake lights. Well, we were safe. We did it. Uh, and it was pouring some of the days, so it's like we tried to get them fixed. We went to two different uh, uh, U-hauls and called them, and they said they couldn't do it. Like it could take a while, and we needed to be like in the next city already. That's probably the worst thing. We tried to fix it in the rain, but it didn't work. Oh yeah. Hope nobody save my seat. No, not bro. Like, all of them are really cool. Like, Spoonhouse again. Yeah. Oh, yeah. House, uh, like, it's like a collective, uh, a co-op. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot of people. It's a really big house. They have, like, their farm. They have a chicken called Goth Chick. <laughs> and uh, Hen Solo. Yeah. Um, they have just, like, a few, like, animals. And, like, it's very communal. And, like, they let us crash there for, like, three nights, I think. We were super obnoxious and just really done with being in the car. And we played with their piano. Oh yeah, and we all got tattoos. We got stick and pokes from Ghost. Check it out. Check it out. So, um, oh, yeah, maybe. <laughs> what? Is there something specific? Uh, for all of the things. Uh, well, I, I don't know if we're allowed to announce it yet. Maybe not, because they haven't. But we have a split coming out with another band. Uh, yeah, we won't say the name yet, but. <laughs> uh, 
So we have a split. And we're just going to be riding a lot. Um, we're going to try to play less shows a little bit. It doesn't work out sometimes. It never works. But just we want to write a lot more music, and then maybe we're planning maybe a little like a short tour to Portland in October yeah. for Halloween, and <laughs> and that's all the long term goals goals we have right now. Love you. We love you. Let's make a noise. One, two.